boy Jake Berlin here with Apocalypse Movies and welcome back to Trailer Reactions. Uh, our live reactions to brand new trailers that are released, first, second, Red Van, everything that's released in the world of trailers. This time we are talking about The Greatest Showman, the Hugh Jackman musical that celebrates the birth of show business with P.T. Barnum, um, the originator of show business, the circus. Um, P.T. Barnum, you know, old school kind of created all of this wackiness back in the day when everyone thought it was absolutely nuts and of course it's played by Hugh Jackman who other or who else would you really want to play this character um, there's been already been a first trailer for this movie it comes out here in just uh, I think it comes out next month um, the first trailer was very strong gave us a good tease of what the uh, movie is actually gonna be Hugh Jackman looks fantastic Zac Efron's in there Zendaya's in there Michelle Williams is in there who she is absolutely fantastic as well so the cast is strong the movie looks really, really good. Man, now the second trailer looks to dive a little bit deeper into it. Um, I have not seen it yet. I'm very interested in seeing it, um, as I'm not a huge fan of musicals. Uh, but this is something that I'm pretty interested in because it has historical relevance. And so, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm interested to check it out. Let's go in and watch the second trailer. Teaser before the teaser, as always. Jackman doing Jackman things. I am not a stranger to the song from the first movie. Still just the Taylor sport. Better luck with your next job. Those people will never accept us. This isn't life I promised you. Not even close. But I have everything I want. Where people can see things they've never seen before. Who's that? Zendaya, Zac Efron. Everyone's got no. <laughs> people aren't gonna like it if you put us on stage. No one counting on it. Well, I believe those are the words of a scoundrel. Oh, Rebecca Sanders Ferguson? I had no idea she was in this. They don't understand yet. So tell me, do you want to go? Where it's covered in all the color lights. Where the brother ways are running the night. Impossible comes true. It's taking over you. Ah, this is the greatest show. Does it bother you that everything you're selling is fake? Ooh. Ooh. Smile, see you, Frank. We have more protesters every day. I tried to preach. You're risking everything you've built. Well, how do you think I built it? Yeah, that's that's a really 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 strong trailer. Um, as I said earlier in the trip, it's Hugh Jackman doing Hugh Jackman things. He's so good in these roles. Obviously, we know him as Wolverine. We love him as Logan. Um, and if obviously you've seen the movie, but he's no longer gonna be Logan, so we may see him um, as this as these kind of characters moving forward. But he's always so strong in these musicals, you know, historical relevance type films. Uh, Zac Efron. Uh, he's uh, he's becoming one of the best young actors in Hollywood. I know a lot of people bag on him for you know past things that have kind of happened, but um, he, he's a really really strong actor, and he's starting to show that in certain roles. Yes, he does Baywatch. Yes, he does Neighbors, that type of stuff. But who doesn't? You know, there are all kinds of movies that that actors do like that. And um, Zendaya, she's popping up like crazy. She was just in Spider Man Homecoming. Really really good in that. Um, this looks like she's going to have an even bigger role. And then Michelle Williams. You can't go wrong with Michelle Williams. Um, she's so underrated. Uh, not a lot of people know who she is, but they should. She is such a fantastic actress. And then the surprise of Rebecca Ferguson, who I had no idea was in this. Um, seeing her in this, I'm excited to see what kind of role she plays. And so, yeah, I'm all on board for this. What kind of hooked me as that we were watching the trailer is um, from the Academy Award lyr winning lyric... lyric 
music writers of uh, La La Land, and that is one of my favorite movies of the past few years. That film is absolutely fantastic, and the fact that it's a musical, having the songs written by them, it just makes sense. Uh, let Hugh Jackman sing his heart out. Uh, that's one of the things that this film looks like it has. It's a major, major heart. It's not just about the show business side of it. It's about you know how it was basically rejected by everyone, and these people were um, just kind of hated by everyone around them, and um, so that that looks like one of the exciting aspects of this film. So I'm very much looking forward to it. The Greatest Showman trailer number two gets a double thumbs up from me. Um, go check it out on ApocalypseMovies.com. If you have not seen it already, get another close-up look at it. Uh, I am Jake Boyan. You can find me on Twitter and Instagram at Qui-Gon Jake. ApocalypseMovies.com every day and this YouTube channel. Go ahead and give us a like, share, comment, and subscribe. We'd really, really appreciate it, guys. Let me know what you think of the trailer in the comment section. And until next time, see you later.